Aidan James Enish just got back from the Expo Sciences International Fair in Abu Dhabi. First thing I noticed was it was very hot <laughs> right when I got out of the airport. The whole science fair was just eye-opening. Other people's projects and being with like-minded people it really inspired me to push my project more. The Niscopi team was one of 36 students from across Canada to attend. Enish won the chance to go after winning the bronze medal at the Canada-wide Science Fair in June. My project is about Labrador tea and its anti-inflammatory properties and arthritis management. I picked this project because uh, my family suffers from arthritis. It's a genetic thing, so I'm basically likely to get it as well. And uh, Labrador tea grows abundantly where I live and also in other communities. And we've been using Labrador tea for years, me and the Scappy people. Enish got to share his project on Labrador tea alongside over 2,000 students from 46 countries. I was very happy to share my traditional knowledge because uh, there's not much people that know about Labrador tea and there's no one at all from across the world that knows about it. And uh, I just hope other people know the benefits of it and also try it one day. I'm a proud teacher uh, of Aidan James Enish and He's not only an incredible student, I believe he's a very humble human. He deserves to be, uh, to be at the International Science Fair. Now that he's home, Enish can't wait for the opportunity to go again next year. I'm also thinking about um, to, the solution for potholes, because I have a lot in my community. <laughs> but also, yeah, I just want to mainly focus on traditional medicine and natural remedies.